Oh, that's not good. That's... What is this? Ho, 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 ho. What are these guys? Hold on a second. What are these? I've never... Oh, my God. Hey guys, Mr. Miola here and welcome to another episode of Ark. I'm so sorry about the wait between last episode and this episode. I, I don't know. I've been going through a few things. Unfortunately, I'm feeling a little burnt out with the game. But it's, it's it, I'm in a difficult place because I want to play it, but I don't know what to do. I'm struggling to find goals or, or things that I want to achieve in the game. Like taming stuff or building stuff, doing this, doing that. I don't know. I don't know if I'm feeling a bit burnt. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's just like Lachlan hasn't been around a whole lot lately or if it's just, I have no idea. But I've been kind of going through that. And then on top of that, over the last two days, I was trying to get the server up, but there was an update and then there was some issues with the host. And then I just couldn't get on the server and the server wouldn't come online and all sorts of issues like that. So I apologize for the break, guys. I'm going to try and break through this little tough period and get back into it. But enough about that, guys. Welcome back to another episode of Ark. If you do enjoy this video, please go ahead and punch the thumbs up. Make it rain those thumbs ups. And if you have any suggestions for things that you'd like to see me do in the game or in this series, because I'm running low on ideas right now, then please help me out by leaving a comment down below. Anyways, between last episode and now, I have done a few little things. One of those things is I finished this elevator. I did actually record this, but I didn't end up uploading the episode because I wasn't happy with it. But um, check it out. It's four stories high now. All we got to do is press E, and it goes and elevates us up to the top floor. I had a lot of placement issues. I moved it around a fair bit, but this was like the, the best place we could put it. It's weird. I couldn't just get it into the one piece. It would it would only work in between the two, which kind of bugs me, but but it's all right. It's it, it's going gonna, it's gonna to be okay. It's going to be okay. I also started moving some of our dinosaurs up here. We've got our two tapajaras. I forgot what they were called. Our two tapajaras up on the sides. We had our argies and stuff up here as well. But right before I hit record on this video, a raptor decided to like run into our base and everything went crazy. Today, what I want to do, I want to spend some more time around the base. I want to try and get all of our dinosaurs finally organized. I've been saying for weeks that I want to get that to happen because right now, it is an absolute mess out there. I want to get it all organized. I want to get everything looking all fine, dandy and fancy. And yeah, but uh, one of those things, one of the things I want to do, in fact, I'm, I, I wanted to test this out. At the bottom of the screen down there, it says, use the number pad to select the stop. How does that work? Doesn't really work. All right, yeah, I don't know. That was weird. It says to use the number pad. I can't get that to work, unfortunately. Oh, and I got... Hold on a second. Why are you over there? You weren't... I think our little level Osaurus there was going to attack the raptor as well because somehow the raptor made it to the walls of our base. I don't know. I don't know how he did that, but he did. Anyways, you help level up my boy Tyrannogod over here. Where is the other guy? I had a... Ah, oh, where's our other dude? Pork chops. You guys were right. As soon as something attacks, he's going to run for his life and like get all scared and run away. He literally did. A raptor came in the base and he ran for his goddamn life. Well, at least we know we ain't going to die. So come back inside, pork chops. Come back inside. Come over here, mate. I just want you to sit there and relax. Just take it easy, bro. Take it easy. Sit there. Now. 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 Let's go and get ourselves our birds again. I want to get these guys, these guys back on the roof. So originally I had these guys. I had them all sort of around the edge. But I want all of our flyers to chill up here for now. That's... Probably the best thing that we can do as far as those guys. We're going to get these big guys out of the way as well because they're just crowding everything up. Let's get him around here. And maybe we'll go and throw him next to Spiny 2 over there. We're going to throw them side by side. We'll go Spiny 1 or OBS. Is that what he called? OB oh, no, that's OB, OB shit. <laughs> All right. Is this someone? That Fiomi is still here. He has no chill. He, he just will not leave. So... He's in my way right now. Get out of the way, buddy. Get out of the way. I'm trying to park my Spino. We got two Spinos down. Where's the third one? He's all, he's all the way over here. So at least if we get them all in one area, they can go chill out and, I don't know, keep each other company. He doesn't actually have a saddle on him. Really? How does he not have a saddle on him? Hopefully he can chase me through all of these guys without getting stuck on them. Hell yeah, he can. And can he, can he chase me into this little parking spot I want him in? Yep, right there. Hell yeah. 
All right, we didn't even need a saddle. That's the way I like it. That is the way I like it. We gotta get rid of this T-Rex as well. He's just, he's just getting in the way. He's in the way. We gotta, we gotta move him. Come on. What's his name? I think he's like T-Rex or something. Let's get you out the way. I reckon we're gonna put him over here. I don't know why. We'll spin him around there. For now, anyway. I'm gonna sit him right there, okay? Now, what is he? What's his name again? Rexed. Rexed is his name. That's, uh, that's Lachlan's. Apparently, he's leveling that thing up high-ish, I think. I don't, I don't entirely, I don't know for sure. Mr. DJ Calico over here. I actually have, I don't think I've ridden him before. Can he throw stuff? He can, he can throw rocks. Hell yeah, that's cool. I think we might have tried that already one time. I can't remember for sure though. And we're going to let him chill on this little platform over here because why not? We're also going to get Pidgeot, Tranagod, or Tranodon, whatever that is over there up here as well. We want all of our flies on the roof just to get him out of the way. It's a perfect place to put him, really. It, it makes sense. Um, we got Spiny or Spino. Stegolus, I mean. Of course I knew his name. What am I saying? And, oh, he's got no saddle on him either. That's a bit disappointing. Stegolus is going to come and chill out. It's a shame he's turning circles so bad. He's going to come and chill out over here somewhere. We're going to go and put him right behind our Spino party. If he wants to turn, the turning circle on this guy is so slow. It sucks so bad. <laughs> Let's go and throw him there. We'll go and stick out Parasaur. Oh, he's got no he's got no saddle either. And Cracklebang. You guys come over here. Both of you follow me. Cracklebang is actually useful. The other guys, we don't use so much. I just want to get them out of the way. Alright, so Paras Parasaur. Parasaur. Come over here, mate. Come over here, buddy. Alright, you're gonna sit right there. Sit right there. Crackle banger, my boy. We want to have him in a useful position so we can use him whenever he, whenever we want. So we're just going to plant him right next to it as well. All right. So now that the area is looking a little more user-friendly, it's still not perfect, but it's a little more user-friendly. There's so much poop everywhere as well. We're also going to get Rainbow Snake out of the way. We got Rainbow Snake. I don't even know how to... I've never, I've never ridden one of these guys before. That's a new, it's a new experience for me, that's for sure. And we're going to park him up here with DJ Calico as well. He's a weird dude. He's a weird type of dude. All right. So next thing I want to take care of, I actually want to go and get some rails. So I'm pressing all sorts of wrong buttons right now. I want to get some uh, stone railing. I think that's what it's called. Stone railing. We've already learned the engram. In fact, there's a special version of it, which is cool. Um, which one is it? That one there. So I want to get a bunch of these to wrap around the top layer of our base. I feel like that would be a cool thing to do. I'm also considering giving a little balcony along there, but it's probably not necessary. So how many railings are we going to need? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 7, 8. We're going to get 28 railings. Now, this is going to take no time at all to collect. I mean, it's pretty basic to collect this stuff. The place is so white as well with all of this snow. Winter Wonderland has ended, but I don't know. The snow's still here for some reason. And I've already forgotten how many railings I need to get. Was it like 28 or something? We can always get extras. We just got to get some stone now. We got plenty of thatch, plenty of wood. What's actually in my inventory at the moment? Because I feel super heavy. We got some fertilizer. Apart from that, it's just wood. All right. So railings, railings, railings. These guys, these things are cheap as. They're going to take no time for us to collect. How much do we need? Like 20, 28? I'll get 24. And then we'll just get a bunch more stone. And that should be good. We should we should have more than enough of everything. Okay. So we're going to get 27, in fact. 27 and then leftover resources. That's going to be more. Way more than we're ever going to need. All right. The problem is I'm currently too heavy to move. I'm too heavy to move. I, I can't. I can't move, unfortunately. That's a little bit annoying. All right, any second. How heavy are these things? Like, like, why am I so heavy right now? We're slowly dropping weight. I guess it's the wood. It's got to be the wood. That's all that could be weighing me down right now. Or the stone, you know. Um, you know what I'm actually going to craft with the rest of this stuff? Can we... Oh, that's not good. That's... What is this? Ho, 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 ho. What are these guys? Hold on a second. What are these guys? Hold on, whoa! What are these? I've never... Oh my god! 
We're so dead. We're so dead. We're so dead. I can't get up. What am I being killed by right now? A Trudon. It's one of the new bird dinosaurs. I've never seen them before. Please leave me be. Please just let me live. What if? <laughs> what a way to experience a new dinosaur. What the hell just happened? All right, all right. What's even going on? Now I'm getting attacked by Dilos. Great. Yeah, we're dead. We're dead. There's no, there's no getting up from this. Wind it up, though. Hurry up. They're too weak. All they're going to do is drain my armor. They're going to ruin my armor. I'm going to have to fly out, get my stuff again. Oh, boy. I don't, I don't want to deal with this sort of stuff. I don't need to deal with this sort of stuff. There we go. There's our boots. There we go, we're dead. Finally. About time. A level 123 Trudon. Well. I wonder if we can tame the little sucker. Problem is, we gotta somehow get in there. We gotta get out there. I got an idea though. I got an idea. Okay. Okay. Huh. Who built this up here? Lachlan must have... Huh. That's kinda cool. That's kinda cool. Alright. Tyrannogods. You're my boy today, mate. You're my main. You're my main man. What I'm going to do, I'm going to fly down here into our little makeshift house trap thing, whatever you want to call this. We're going to shut it. We're then going to fly up here and try and find that little Trudon. The one that killed us. That high level thing. There they are. Dilo's attacking a Diplo. Not, not the smartest decision it's made in its life. But where's the... Where's the... Where's the Trudon? Is it this thing here? Can I pick it up? Did I get it? I got it. I got it. Do I got it? I think I got it. I got him. Okay, we've picked it up. Now, I'm going to drop him straight into this little thing. And then hopefully he won't be able to escape. I hope it's the level 123 one. Okay, you stay right there, little guy. Can you get out? All right, he's not attacking anything. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Time to do some recon work. We got to find out how to actually tame these guys. What even? Okay. This is weird. Apparently to tame these guys, it's a passive tame. So you don't shoot them with arrows. But what you need to do is feed them tames. Feed them your tames. You got to sacrifice your animals to it. And let it kill them. And then it, it, it gains experience on its own. This is weird. This is so weird. Okay. I'm just trying to think of how we're going to achieve this though. We're going to have to find some dodos. Tame some dodos. And then drop them in there to get devoured. This is savage. All right, though. Um, we need berries, I guess. I guess we need berries. Crackle banger, my boy. It's time to, for you to be used. There's a few little bushes over here. We're going to go and get some medjos out of it. Try and find some dodos. Tame those dodos and then feed them to the guy. I have no idea how many he actually needs, though. Okay. So, I don't think we can tame the thing. It's telling me from what I'm reading, from what I'm reading, if you wanted to tame it with one animal, with one dinosaur, you need to feed him, or well, the only way you're doing it is feeding like a level 150, a 70, level 75 wyvern at night time, because that means double experience, okay? That's ridiculous. That is absolutely ridiculous. Oh, crap. I'm going to get my dead body. <laughs> okay, where's my body at? Where's my body? There's my bag. Oh my god. Oh. I nearly forgot all my stuff. That would have been devastating. I can't even run home right now because I'm too heavy. All right. Um, all right. All right. All right. So, yeah. Um, you need a level 75 wyvern at night time because at night time you get double experience from, like, getting them to slay your tames. You would need a level 75 wyvern at night time, which gives it the double experience to tame the guy up. Dodos is going to take, like, hundreds of the little dodos to tame ourselves a level 103 Trudon. So... I might need to do a little bit more research into this before we try and tame one of these guys because that is just weird. That is so weird. Anyways, we're going to ignore that for now. We're going to leave him down there. If he's there, when I'm ready to tame the guy, then cool. If he's not, then too bad. For now, though, I just want to put these little railings down around our base. So we've got 27 of them in the end. I also went and created a 4x4 wall, so that might come in handy as well. So let's go and place these guys around. We got... This side, majority, majority covered already. I like it. It's a nice little topping, just to like top it all off. 
Is there anything cool we can do with these? No, we can just pick them up. In fact, is there anything like, I don't know. Let's just go S plus. Is there anything actually cool looking, different or whatever that we can get that substitutes for these or not really? It looks like that's about it. it that, that, that's it. All right. Yeah, there's nothing special. Nothing special. So let's keep placing these things down. I don't know how I'm going to get around this Tapajera though. Is all? Can I, can I crawl between his legs? Oh, can I get through? Come on. I guess not. All right. Hopefully we can like hop off his back. No, we're going to fall. Oh, that kind of hurt. Let's get our elevator back down. Come on. Come back down and pick me up. I need to come up. And we'll stop it and elevate me again. All right. So oh, that was the tough part down, I suppose. Here we go. Let's finish this off. We got one. We got two. We got three. We got four. We got nine more. We might actually need a few extras. One, two, three. How many more? Six left. I think we're going to be short here. One over there. Um, nope. One there. There are different levels. Hold on just a second. Hold on just a second. Why are they at different levels? Hold on. Hold, hold the front door. I've got a feeling some of these are sitting on the ceiling. And some of them are locking onto the wall instead. Are there different levels? Yes, there are. There's different levels that they can sit at. Wow, we all want them at the same level. Right? They still didn't place right. Nah, they, they, they just want to go down. It's not making a difference. All right, whatever. It's just a little difference. It's all good. It's all good. Place that one there. That one there. That one there. That one there. Tell me we're not one short right now. We're one short. No way. No way. No way. No way. Can I make another one? You're not going to let me make another one? We're, we're like a little bit of stone short. Ah, oh, we should have a little bit lying around somewhere, right? Tell me we've got a little bit of stone in here. We do. Hell yeah. Okay. Um... Can we craft that? All right, we got one of them on the way. And while we're here, we may as well repair our armor because our armor is absolutely shredded right now. It's not that good. It's pretty bad, actually. So let's go repair. Oh, man, we don't have enough metal in here now. Why did I spend it all on the elevator or something? Oh, we got, we got a bunch here, though. That's all good. All right, all right, all right, all right. And now armor. Oh, it's not, it's not entirely ready just yet. Our helmet's ready. Just the body piece, and then we're good to go. There it is. Awesome. Okay, we're looking pretty good. We just got to throw one more barrier piece back down on top of the roof. And we have this thing all sealed up now. As for things I still want to achieve... Can I build on this or not? I guess not. That's a bit disappointing. As for things... Oh, we probably... Yee. Yee. We probably got to put one there as well. Yeah, we do. That's annoying. If we fall down there, we're going to get stuck down there. You don't want to get stuck in, the, in this game. Because once you're stuck, you stay in there forever. All right. Let's finish this off properly. One there and one there. Now, that's all good. We're done up here. Eventually, I'm thinking of putting another floor on top of this. Like a tower or something. But there really is no purpose to do that just yet. Um, also, I was considering having a little outdoor station out here. I wasn't sure what I was going to put on it. I was thinking of having like a campfire and some stuff like that, but I'm not entirely sure. I think it could be kind of cool, but probably pointless at the same time. So we'll see what happens. Eventually as well, I was hoping to redo this wall. I don't like it and I'd like to push it out a little bit further and have it maybe like down here somewhere. A little bit further down here. I don't really know why. Just to give us some more room inside the base, but... Again, and because and it's scrappy as all hell. Like, it's, it's really badly built. Uh, I'd like to redo it, but we'll see how that goes. It's probably, it's very unnecessary. Probably just a big waste of time. All right, guys, it's night time, and night time is like pure, it's, 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 it's supply drop spawning time. You can already see there's a couple of them popping up around the place. So let's go. We're going to get on our guardian angel, wherever he is. He should be upstairs. We're going to get on our guardian angel. We're going to take him out for a ride and hopefully find some cool supply drops somewhere around the place. Guardian Angel, my boy. What can we find? Let's have a look. Let's throw some gamma on the game. Is there anything but greens? Because right now, it's just looking like a whole lot of green. There's a blue, green, a white, or is that a gold? 
That's a white. Oh, we want to find some reds. Let's see if we can head over in this direction. I think this is where all the reds and golds tend to spawn. Hopefully, now, I, I'm pretty sure I, expe I extended night time to make it last longer. Originally, it was lasting like a minute. It was a little bit extreme, but I've made it last a little bit longer, so hopefully that does work. It's We're just getting a lot of blues and greens, though. Can we get something a little bit better? I mean, the difficulty's at, like, 0.8, so there wouldn't be many reds spawning, but usually there's at least a couple at night time. Except for now. Except for right now. This is lots of blues and greens. More blues and greens. Are you kidding? That's a little bit disappointing. Now, is that a gold over there or is that a white? I look, I think that's a gold. That's a gold. All right. We find ourselves something kind of good. It's the second best color we can get. Are we heavy? No, we're good. We're good. I feel like we're weighing down our Tyranodon a little bit too much, but it's, I don't think it's actually that bad. All right. We're getting close. We're getting close. Our stamina is running a little bit low as well, but ah, it should be all right. We should make it just on the one landing. Oh, I'm looking down there. There's a lot of dinosaurs and stuff that are going to want us dead. I probably shouldn't be pushing my stamina this close to, to low, but it's all good. We're going in. Oh, look at that. We landed right here. Is there anything? Anything coming to kill me? So far, so good. Okay, awesome. It looks like we might have a clear run in and out to get this gold beacon. Give me something good, baby. Give me something good. Come on. A megalodon saddle and a, and a, and a scope of some sort. What? What? That's all? That's all you're going to give me? A Megalodon saddle? Now that's a bit disappointing. It looks like nighttime's nearly over as well. I, maybe I gotta slow it down a little bit more. That sucks. That's all we're gonna get. Mm. But yeah, I, I really don't know what went wrong with this nighttime. It's all green and blues. That never happens. Usually there's at least a purple, a gold, or maybe a red. But, but greens and blues? That's unheard of. Either way, though, we're going to wrap this episode up here. Thank you so much for watching this episode of ARK. Remember to help me out by leaving suggestions down in the comments of things you'd like to see me do in these episodes. I need ideas. I know we're going to go taming some stuff. It's been, well, it's been a while since we've tamed some dinosaurs. But that's it for this one, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please go ahead and punch the thumbs up. Make it rain those thumbs ups. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye for now. Yeah.